Boscombe is now the UK's most innovative seafront and home to Europe's first artificial surf reef, thanks to an £11 million regeneration scheme. The reef is the first of its kind in the Northern Hemisphere. Its effect on the seafront and community are clear to see, and the area has been transformed. Boscombe is a short walk away from Bournemouth, the UK's leading seaside resort. In its Victorian heyday, Boscombe was the place to be. People travelled from all over the country to holiday there, as it was believed its spa water and pine trees were health-giving. However, in recent decades, lack of investment saw the area decline. In 1999, the idea of creating an artificial surf reef was first raised. The free-to-use sports facility would attract visitors and encourage regeneration in the area. Bournemouth Borough Council sold an underused car park to finance the scheme but it wasn't until 2007 that the council received special permission from the government to build the reef. The reef is made from a base layer, a top layer and a ramp which points seawards. Each layer consists of two elements, a webbing base and huge geotextile bags. Geotextile means that the special material is environmentally friendly and actually attracts marine life which grows on the bags. The webbing base and empty sandbags arrived in Bournemouth in summer 2008. The base was laid out onto a field and the first section of sandbags was attached to it. The section was then concertinaed by huge cranes and laid onto a barge, ready for transportation to the marine construction site. In August 2008, Bournemouth finally had the perfect weather conditions required to lay the first section onto Boscombe's seabed, just east of Boscombe Pier. Watched by national TV crews and journalists from all over the country, divers went down and carefully attached one end of the first reef section to anchor blocks. A barge was then slowly pulled out and the section sank onto the seabed. Then, the construction team pumped each bag full of sand that had been specially harvested on Boscombe Beach. The largest bags were 70 metres long, 2 metres high and 6 metres wide. The base layer of the reef was completed, but poor weather meant that work had to stop until spring 2009. Eventually in the autumn, the top layer and ramp was laid and filled to complete Europe's first artificial surf reef. It's the size of a football pitch and positioned 250 metres offshore to make waves break further away from the beach and provide a longer ride. It does not work like a wave machine would as it does not create waves where none exist. If the sea is calm and flat, it will remain so. However, if there's a good-sized swell, it mimics a natural reef by acting as a ramp, pushing existing waves upwards and channels them along the length of the structure. The natural waves are enhanced and they break with more power than those on the beach, creating right-hander waves for surfers and bodyboarders. The reef is an additional surf break to those either side of Boscombe and Bournemouth piers. It's free to surf and the RNLI provides safety cover on the reef 365 days of the year. The reef has also had a positive effect on marine life as a variety of species now live on the reef including crabs, lobster, pipefish, sea bass and mullet. As a result of this unique project, Boscombe has enjoyed global publicity gaining coverage in over 60 countries worldwide. New hotels, shops and restaurants have opened up and given Boscombe a boost. Around 80 jobs have been created along the seafront alone. The reef has been a catalyst for change as the seafront has been transformed and now hosts changing facilities and warm showers. Boscombe Pier End has been rebuilt and is a great platform to watch surfers and bodyboarders in action. The seafront also hosts the famous beach pods, which are beach huts with a modern twist. They have been interior designed by fashion designers Wayne and Geraldine Hemingway, and each one offers a retro interior, kitchenette, bespoke beach furniture, and fantastic sea views from a private balcony. The beach pods are available to buy and rent from the seafront office. Visitors can now come down to Boscombe, stay in a boutique hotel, eat in a glamorous seafront restaurant, bask in the renovated gardens, learn to surf, kayak or bodyboard and enjoy a brand new Boscombe, the UK's most innovative seafront.
For more information, please visit bournemouth.co.uk.